Wildcat star Sean Reddidge will be battling more than a few nerves when he takes to the court tomorrow against Adelaide, the Cats' co-captain, today returning to the City of Churches, the place where he dislocated and fractured his hip last season, an injury which almost ended his NBL career. I think he's pretty apprehensive, to be honest. Uh, tomorrow night's actually his 200th game as well. Uh, and, it, and it's going back to the place where it happened. Uh, and there's no doubt he'll have some butterflies for sure. The Cats are confident the big man will return to his best, while Matt Knight's ankle injury is only expected to keep him sidelined for a week. Thanks, Tyson. Have, have a good night. A productive pre-season has the Wildcats' favourites heading into a new NBL season. Sean Redditch will play his 200th match against bitter rivals the Adelaide 36ers tomorrow night. Sean Redditch seemed relaxed enough today as he prepared to revisit the scene of his nasty hip injury. The coach has no doubt about Redditch's fitness. None whatsoever. He's been incredible. He's had lots of hits. Hit the floor five, six times, going, gets up. Uh, no concerns whatsoever. While Redditch is back to play, Beveridge is here to stay as he prepares to extend his contract with the Cats. Love it here. Love it. This is my home. Uh, Perth's treated me, uh, it's been tremendous, everything. You know, wife, kids, everybody's happy, so can't see any reason why I'd want a little leave. Andrew Bogut's proposed move to the NBL is off after the NBA star was unable to secure an insurance deal to cover his $39 million Milwaukee Bucks contract. The Aussie was hoping to play with the Kings during the NBA lockout. 